This YouTube channel is all about giving tips and tricks for Valorant. But lately, I've been really struggling to rank up. This is why I asked a Radiant player to coach me. During the coaching session, I just played the game and he commented and gave tips and tips during the game. Things I know of myself, I play way too aggressive and my aim is not on point always. But maybe the coach will find different things that I never noticed on my own gameplay. So yeah, let's meet the coach. Who am I speaking to? Who are you? Well, my name is uh, Amplified, or I go by Amplified in-game in Valorant. Um, I've been playing ever since beta release and I've reached Radiant and top 150 Europe. <laughs> top 150, easy peasy for you my friend. Okay, uh, before we start in the game, uh, do you have uh, things you want to say? What, what are you gonna look at uh, during the games? And uh... Well, of course, the movement is very important. Um, yeah, basic stuff, but I'll also be looking at positioning um, calling out to teammates using your microphone because those are important factors in ranking up because mm -hmm. this video is going about how to rank up and not really how to be a professional player right mm -hmm. yeah yeah true. so i'll be focus on tips how you can rank up well i'll see what i'll be focusing on in the video because i don't know what you're doing wrong yet Ex exactly was... exactly uh let's yeah. let's just start the game and uh, let's see how it's yeah going we'll then. see Amplify it's also from the Netherlands, but I guess some people heard it from this accent. <laughs> <laughs> Minor Hello. Dutch accent. Okay, let's so. start off with the first tip. Normally, you don't insta log Gent, but uh, <laughs> Mr. Lowlander had to, because it's the series it's the series. Jet to Immortal. So, uh, normally, yeah. if you want to rank up, you don't insta log. It's a, like team comp is important, very important, or is it just like. Yeah. Well, what? it's not that important. It's more the like team spirit. I've won more games with five duelists than I've lost with them. Let's say it like that. But you always, when you have, for example, like that one toxic player that wants to have yeah. smokes, then it's better to play smokes because the yeah, teams... Yeah, that's probably true. Ah, you want to okay. keep the keep the toxic player satisfied. <laughs> <laughs> and if you can't, you just mute them. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah. yeah, that was pretty unlucky. Uh, there should have been a wall there, or the Phoenix should have been able to hear that Yoru went kitchen, I think. Um, you got the first two frags, actually, so it was 5v3. So maybe you w it's better to wait, like, um, stay with your team with the 5v3. Because yeah. with Spectres, they're good enough weapons. If, you are, if you're um, shooting with two on range against the Vandal, you will probably kill him. Maybe one dies, but you will still kill him. So if you just trade out then... Then you get around because you're 5v3. They gave up two free frags to the killjoy. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I messed up. The yeah, flesh. That was how you should play it though. Just a peek on the sky, that was well played. Yeah. And uh, try to look away for your Spike flashes. Try to go for the. Or the refrag on sky, like yeah, use sky that's as how bait. you play it. Especially, yeah, you could call it a bait, but it's actually just swinging off each other, and all the pro MVP players do it. Even if your teammate gets mad Chris sometimes, oh, you're baiting me. It's actually <laughs> better. <laughs> yeah, true. Spike down A. Oh, uh... one enemy remaining. <laughs> I'm already. <laughs> I, I'm so rusty, dude. It's insane. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. With Jet Ult, I'm not really that big of a fan of updrafting. I, I just like more jumping and floating. Even when you're already on top of the, uh, like on top of that big wall, big screen, you could just probably float it off instead of updrafting for the Viper. Yeah, you're vulnerable when you updraft. Poison spike oh. down mid. Oh boy. Nasty. Going up. Nice. One enemy remaining. Check it anyway. Okay, cool. You're reflected himself. Yeah, I saw it. I saw it. <laughs> but, but when I'm holding this, do you like recommend to hold it like this? No, no, wait till the never flesh? all the way in the corner. Because if you're all the way in the corner, people from the far, like from the far angle, can see you before you can see them. It's pr uh, ping that for a sec. Yeah, there. If they enter there and you stand all the way in the corner, they can see your weapon or shoulder, and you can't see them. Oh. So you go a bit to the right. Oh yes. Yeah. So this. Wait. No. Uh, or no, the other side of the the box or the other side of the wall. I mean. No. The, yeah. Other. <laughs> the right side. The right side. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, like this. That side. Yeah. yeah okay. 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 Those line up. Yeah. You got it. I understand. I understand. Yeah. You know, no one is close. Night. Night. Hey. Jago Peeker. We got him. We got him. Also. 
a question I have with jiggle peeking. Is it better to jiggle peek like this? One enemy or remaining. better from a longer range? Enemy well, um, of always longer range, actually. Because yeah. um, if you're further away from a corner, you can see the opponent earlier. No, yeah, and jiggle peeking is also just tagging when you can commit. Yeah. Like if you see one person, uh, he's miss he missed his first shot, he's already spraying at you, you can probably just full swing and then it's much better to stand further away. Oh, oh I missed it. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> this one enemy remaining. Yeah, this I always um, try to insta turn for the arrow. I think your aim is really good enough to just shoot it before the first pulse, and that's always yeah. worth, in my opinion. And now upgrade armor, or should I save? Uh, never upgrade armor. No. Also. No. <laughs> never. No? Only if you have over 5k. Oh my god! I can't <laughs> slow. I knew it was coming. <laughs> Yeah, as well. And your team was running already. You should probably just also run. Uh, no oh, yeah. real needs, or no real reason to shift them. Winnable. <laughs> 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 yeah. Um, you might want to drop the spike the sage and and pull off a, a yampy. You know, you smoke side and you dash in it. Mm -hmm. it gives a great amount of pressures. Like people don't know what to do with the jets. Somewhere on side in smokes. It's making a lot of noise. Noise. Uh, that, that's the peak advantage, uh, what, what you talked about here. earlier. Yes, sir. Let's go. Oh, I messed up. Oh. oh my god. Imagine. <laughs> Imagine if he just sprays you down there. <laughs> that was quite risky. But that yeah. over there I'm was also not really a big fan of dashing out in the open in their spawn, because she can just peek you from six different angles. For the, for, the, for the play, it's cool, but it's like <laughs> not really a uh, good use of utility <laughs> or even like a good precision to be in at all. That's, that's also like a big mistake what I always make is like I'm way too aggressive. Placing swarm grenade. Like, let's just play safe, right? Yeah, yeah. You should just play far away. Well, you see your team is. <laughs> they're the team not playing safe, you should play with them. Just, okay. uh, swing heaven as well. Go back. Yeah, now you can play safe because they're not peeking now, I hope. <laughs> Yeah. Right. Like, so, of course, it's best if everyone just goes back here and plays the after plan because it's planned for heaven or for far away. But, like, you see, your four teammates are pushing side, there's no holding back, platinum's wanting a kill. Yeah, so yeah, just I, go them. I understand. Okay, oh, what the heck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you had the good intentions I saw with the smoke, but uh, you missed it. <laughs> That's unlucky. Oh my god, I can't do that. Okay, <laughs> One enemy remaining. Good job, dude. Nice. Hey, so it went well now, but what I would have done is you saw their Viper and their um, Jet were both alive. She saved the smoke, and if you're playing from really far away, especially if you're Jet, you don't have Util, uh, let's say your team lost those duels, you can't cancel the fuse then, because they can just smoke off the bomb. So Jet and Viper can do that, so here I should have played a bit closer. So if your team dies, and yeah, that's better, or Nest. If your team dies nice, um, and they smoke spike and start sticking it, you can just dash in or push them at least. Uh, okay. Oh. okay yeah, you can still uh, like run with your team. If you just have your crosshair there, if you're like scared to flick and miss, mm -hmm. you can still run. Because shifting and shooting is always on time for the first pulse. So you can just come to a full stop, shoot it before it pops once. Bad position at smoke. Oh, shit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You, you, you said it yourself already. Yeah. You might want to updraft, <laughs> just updraft back over the wall. I think that's really worth there. Ah, good, good game, boys. Good game. Yes. And uh, let's give a general tip for Killjoys now. Please yeah. don't wait until they tap the spike and then pop your uh, your nano swarms. Because any normal thing you play will just shoot the nano swarms before they tap the spike, and then yeah. you're too late. <laughs> Global tips: Watch Mr. Lowlander's video. You will learn everything <laughs> until uh, until diamond. You will learn everything what you need. Uh, cross your <laughs> placement, movement, aiming, <laughs> aim training. They can learn those things on my channel, but, but me, myself, I still need to work on a lot of those things. I, yeah, I well, what you probably should work on first is just aiming, aiming in general. What I like to do to improve my aim is watch good aimers. 
um, not people like tense because that's really like you can't reach that level of aim, I think. But more, mm. I I really think it's really useful to watch Scream because Scream is just godlike crosshair placement. I I want to thank you so much. It's it's been like a wonderful wonderful experience. I I learned a lot. Um, uh, and you're ready to go to Immortal now. Yeah, dude. So those were the games with Amplified. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something. And I see you in the next one. Peace.